Hey guys, how's it going? So I'm just, uh, you know, hanging out with this wizard here. It's pretty sweet. <laughs> uh, so we're in Battle Creek today. Um, yesterday we got some really good photos out by Gall Lake. And um, yeah, we was able to add a couple couple nice shots to the portfolio. But uh, we're out here at Lila Arboretum in Battle Creek right now. I'm just uh, taking a break on my way downtown. Today what I want to do um, is actually uh, do some street photography where we just kind of do some candid shots. We kind of stalk some people <laughs> It's gonna be fun and uh, And just get some get some real raw uh, Emotions some real raw uh, Images of the, of the city of Battle Creek um, And so that's what the plan is to do is for today. And we'll bring you along on the journey so Down, I just pulled down the side alley thinking that this would be a good spot to just turn around to go back into town and I ended up just stumbling upon this. So I got some pretty good, cool pictures, some pretty good footage and uh, um, actually just, uh, just across the way I actually got some uh, pictures of a guy fly fishing uh, right here in Battle Creek. So it's kind of funny, um, the pictures look like he's out in the wilderness but he's actually like right right downtown like there's cement walls on either side of him <laughs> but uh, so so far so good um, let's go ahead and actually go downtown and see if we can't actually get some like candid shots of people on the street so uh, here we go <laughs> Um, this is pretty close to downtown, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, take our good Nikon P530 and uh, just start walking to see what we can find. doing street photography we want to be able to capture candid shots really quickly so I've set my camera I don't have I don't have my preferred camera for this um, but I'm just using my main camera that I have right now which is the Coolpix P530 until I can afford a high high-end DSLR this is this is what I'm shooting with so uh, we're making do with what we got we've got it set up on aperture priority here make sure we set it on aperture priority so that we're getting you know, the crisper shots, if we set on shutter priority and we're shooting quick, we might get some washed out areas. We might not get the detail we want. So we're gonna set on aperture priority and we're also gonna put uh, on continuous burst. So we get a lot of shots really quickly uh, and a fine quality. So that's the strategy. And I'm just gonna find a spot here downtown and set up. Sometimes when you're taking shots, you gotta get down closer to the ground or up high. You gotta get a different angle on the thing that you're shooting to give it that just that extra dramatic effect. And the reason why that is is because most people, we see the world from eye level. We're all used to seeing things this way, so it doesn't really stand out when we see something that we would normally see from eye level. But when we take that and we move that angle and we change it, we change the angle that we're shooting at, we give that, that interesting look because we don't normally see things from that angle. I think that's pretty cool. So right here, there's a really good natural light source. As you can see, I got kind of these patterns on my face. This would be a nice spot to take maybe some portrait. So if I were to take maybe some photos of somebody sitting down with some of this on here, kind of soften that light a little bit. In post, I might be able to really make this a interesting photo. See, you get some of those patterns coming across the body. Well, we didn't get as many uh, candid photos as I wanted to get today. Uh, it was kind of hit and miss. There wasn't a lot of people walking around. It just isn't uh, the busy time of day. I should probably come in the evening. Uh, I might get some more, you know, some better shadows and some better lighting. See if we can't find some more people, because um, that was my goal today, was to get more shots of people. 
and I did ended up getting a lot of architecture, which I love. I love doing architecture photography, but um, I, I was preferring, I was hoping to kind of boost my portfolio in the people area today. Thanks for watching my Southwest Michigan photo vlog, and uh, we'll uh, see you in episode number three coming up tomorrow. So like and subscribe to the channel, and we'll catch you later. Peace out. Thank you.